Are you somebody who actually enjoys walking, running, moving around, exercising and being able to do your own activities of daily life? But off late, it could be for the last few years or post COVID, you have been finding it difficult and you have pain when you do the physical activities you enjoy then this is the video you should really be interested in. I am Dr. Santosh Jacob. I am an orthopedic surgeon and a regenerative or stem cell medicine specialist from the beautiful city of Chennai, which is in Tamil Nadu, India. I specialize in conventional orthopedics like trauma or fracture surgeries and joint replacements. But my passion is in minimal access orthopedics and regenerative orthopedics. What that implies is I use non-cutting, no knife techniques and cells in your own body to heal a host of diseases which you have developed over period of years. So this sounds a bit crazy, yes, because it's almost like renewable health. I'm telling you that we can use your cells in your body to treat your diseases. This is not crazy. Many countries, the US, the UK, Europe, Korea, India have been using cells from your body, your bone marrow cells, your fat cells and a product called platelet rich plasma which is harvested from your blood to treat a host of diseases like neck pain due to cervical spondylosis or disc issues, low back pain due to a disc bulge or wear and tear of your spine, shoulder issues like a frozen shoulder or rotator cuff injuries, ligament tears, hip pain and knee pain because of arthritis and other issues of ligament injuries, foot and ankle pain due to wear and tear and also a host of other sports injuries can be treated using your own cells from your bone marrow, from your fat and using platelet rich plasma from your blood. Now, if you're interested in this, just give me one more minute to explain how these cells are harvested from you and the basic science of how they work. So there are three types of cells that we use. One is bone marrow concentrate and that is harvested from your pelvic bone where the cells are at the highest concentration. These cells have a lot of stem cells that is cells which can produce bone cells, ligament cells and cartilage cells. But apart from this, there are a host of growth factors like vascular endothelial growth factor. This one especially helps in new blood vessel formation. And all of you know that when new blood vessels form, healing takes place. Then there are other growth factors like insulin-like growth factor and transforming growth factor, which helps in repair and regeneration of tissues. Very similarly, when we harvest cells from your fat, we mostly take it using liposuction from your abdomen and your fat cells also contain very similar amount of growth factors and stem cells which can help repair and regenerate various joints and tissues. Coming to PRP or platelet rich plasma, this is harvested from your venous blood that is we put in an IV, take some blood and platelet rich plasma is processed. Platelet rich plasma though does not have too many stem cells but it does have enough growth factors to treat early injuries, early osteoarthritis, where your disease process is not really advanced. Now that we have understood how they work and how they are harvested, I also want to tell you that most of these procedures are done as a daycare procedure and you need a maximum of 24 hours admission in the hospital. And also, if you're a little bit pain tolerant, these procedures can be done under local anesthesia itself. All right, I've said almost everything I have to say. If you want more information about what kind of procedures we do, then please log on to www.drsantoshjacob.com or just follow my YouTube channel. I have a number of videos about shoulder pain, neck pain, low back pain, and also hip and knee arthritis, along with testimonials from 
patience about how they are feeling after the procedure. All right, guys, see you soon. If you liked the content of this video and you found it useful, please like, share and subscribe so that I can make more informative, interesting videos like this. Signing off, Dr. Santosh Jacob from the beautiful city of Chennai, Tamil Nadu in India. From day four, three or four, I was walking with a walker and day nine, no more walker, no more crepe bandage. I was walking without anything. And today I am uh, pretty much walking on my own two feet. Before the surgery, I had a lot of problems in walking. But after the surgery, I'm finding it so convenient and it's become so easy for me now by the grace of God. We don't need it there, not even a scar. A scar, see, I can rub here. So, or pain, so rumba happy. After the surgery or post surgery, immediately post surgery or after three months, I don't have any, any pain, pain in my back. Very, that, yeah. I never had any pain in my back.